Hi everyone, so today we are going to try Deepseek Air One. So it was released not uh, a few hours ago and uh, we will test it via their website, which is the full version of the Air One Deepseek. We also going, are going to test it um, in uh, with Olama, so running locally. We are going to test the Air One 1.5B distilled version but also the 7B version. So both of them are quantized and distilled and we will uh, try them uh, gradually and uh, via, um, via creating a Pac-Man game in Python without any external uh, assets. And uh, we are going to test it uh, via, uh, we are also going to compare it against a uh, Quen coder to see which one does the best for, um, for generating. So let's insert it and try to run it. So I think there is some issues. So we get some issues. So. Uh, as you can see, the one the one point five B is not enough uh, smart to uh, make a Pac-Man game in Python, but I think the latest will give the, us uh, a, uh, a good start. So let's select it and run it again. Let's go. By the way, I'm running it on my 3090 with 24 gigabytes of VRAM. So it should be pretty fast. And uh, I'm using, uh, so th this is the Quen distilled version because you can also see Lam Lama distilled versions, as you can see right there. So I'm using the Quen 1.5, 7B Quen, but there is also the Lama uh, version, which I'm not using. So uh, let's try it. And I don't see any errors, but it is using uh, images. So I'm going to say, do not use any external assets. So let's try. Uh, in the same time, I'm going to ask this the same question to the full version, which I will be running on uh, their website for free. You can see the website right there. So let's ask him and you will see it is pretty fast. So I'm going to copy this, paste it and run it. Oh, it did not understand that I needed to to do not have any external um, assets. So I think it will not work. Yeah, so that's a fail. I'm going to try also with uh, Quen. So let's try with Quen 7B to be fair, because this is already a 7B model. Let's try and let's see. Oh, it is still reasoning. Okay. We will let him do uh, his thing. So now let's test the Quen version. And it's use, it is using curses, but I don't have curses. Uh, with Pygame. Oh, it's strange. And it is still thinking. It's thinking so much, man. <laughs> this is insane. So this is the issue with uh, thinking models. It's that they are thinking a lot, so it takes time. And it also takes a lot of money because you pay for each tokens even for thinking. Uh, okay, so we have an error. 
So for now, no model, no model has been able to to give me a, a working um, a working game. But I'm using seven B models, so they are pretty uh, pretty small. I think the bigger model will be able, but we will see with uh, what uh, issues. So it is running, but uh, it's the maze is strange. <laughs> I, I can move, but I don't understand uh, what is going on. So for me, this is a this is a fail. Oh, it has finished. It takes two minutes to think. Let's try. Oh, this is pretty good, man. We have animations, enemies, a good maze with dots. And uh, let's see if we can die. Yeah, we can die. So this is a fully working game. And we even have a score and collisions and all, the, all of these things. So for me, that's really a pass. This is amazing mail. I want to try against ChatGPT. Uh, let's ask him the same question. And I think ChatGPT, uh, so this is a GPT-40. It will do, um, uh, we will have a, a game that, is, uh, that will be less good. Oh, with, Pi game. Send. Oh, fuck. Send again. And I will also ask Claude. So we will compare all of them. So one thing that is great with uh, GPT-40 against uh, R1 or O1 is that uh, the inference speed uh, to get the final code is way better. You don't have to think for minutes. You can just um, give the code instantly, and it also costs way way less. So for, this is pretty damn good. Let's try the Claude one. Let's see what we will get. Oh, it's even better. Yeah, I like this. The only issue is that. Uh, we can move freely. There is not really a grid. We can even go in diagonal. And uh, <laughs> enemies are completely broken and stuck into the wall. Let's run it again. So for now, R1 did better. But uh, enemies are, have a small AI, which is quite dumb. Let's try chat GPT. Let's copy it and run it. Okay, <laughs> this is pretty bad. <laughs> this is more like a snake game than uh, <laughs> uh, a Pac-Man game. Ah, let's see if we can die. Okay, we can't die. Okay, this is pretty bad. <laughs> so, my uh, if I will rank the AIs. I will say that DeepSeek is by far the best after we get Claude, which is quite good. And in the last uh, stage, we get ChatGPT, which is really, really uh, bad. <laughs> and uh, I hope you liked this video. If you find it helpful, you could subscribe and uh, leave a comment. I love comments. Uh, I, read, I read them all the time. And uh, you can suggest, for, for example, new ideas of videos, new ideas of questions to ask to AIs. Uh, if you have any issues, I can help you. So yeah, uh, have a nice day. Bye-bye.